So everybody, welcome back to another vlog. I'm gonna set this up. I got a ring light because as you guys know, my apartment has like these big windows and I kind of rely on the natural light during the day to film my videos and it gets kind of annoying when the light's not good. So uh, I ordered a ring light and I'm gonna set it up and maybe do a little haul for you guys to start off the vlog. This haul seems like it's gonna be like really official because I have like my light set up. Um, but I just kind of wanted to like test it out and see what it would be like even though this is just in a vlog So I wanted to include this stuff just because it's a few pieces that I picked up from boohoo They just have really trendy and affordable items So when I go on boohoo I find like a few things that I like and then I end up buying so much more Just because everything is so inexpensive So I just wanted to show you guys some of the items that I got because I've been getting a lot of questions I've been wearing them in some of my most recent Instagram posts and you guys have noticed So I just wanted to share with you guys some of the items that I got and also sorry if I sound really sick I've been so so sick since honestly Wednesday and today's Sunday so for the past week I've been so sick and like yeah so that's why I like sound like this so anyway some of the things that I got I just picked up some joggers um, you guys know that I always wear joggers. I think I might end up giving these to my sister because they don't fit me like I wanted them to. I like to wear my joggers more like oversized and big. And I got these in a size US 6 and they're just these tan, plain, high-waisted joggers. They're still really cute, but I know that they'd fit her more loose and they're just like a little bit too tight on me. So I got one pair of those and then I also got a set. It was like an athleisure um, little tan pants with this little matching sweatshirt right here actually which was really cool i really like this because it's just like super big and oversized so that is the first two things that i got and then i also picked up another pair of like satin jogger pants and i like to wear these like when i go out to dinner on the weekends or if i go to any events or stuff like that i'm um, just throwing on like a pair of high-waisted pants i just love wearing them with a bodysuit so i got these black ones and they're just like satin high-waisted ones with a little tie and then also i got a few bodysuits and the bodysuits i usually get are in a size six and they just fit me really well um from boohoo and i got this black one that has a little like turtleneck detailing and then just snaps at the bottom which i think is really nice because i hate wearing bodysuits that like don't snap together at the bottom i just feel like it's like so much easier when you like are out in public and you go to the bathroom and you can just take them off and not have to literally take the whole bodysuit off at once so i just got a plain black turtleneck one you can really never go wrong with those um i love just having like plain black black bodysuits in my closet because these ones right here that are so fun to wear, just like patterned ones. I got this black and red snakeskin print one, but you can only wear these so many times, which I hate because like I wear it once and then I never wanna wear it again because I see it and I'm like, I literally already wore that, so I like want it away. Um, but it's good because Boohoo's so inexpensive, so you can like buy things like this and then wear it once and then like not feel bad about not wearing it ever again because it was not that much money. But this one I also got in a size six. It's kind of like the same. Um, fit it just has like that high neck long sleeves perfect for winter and again it just has the little snaps at the bottom which I love and then I got a few accessories and I got this neon green beanie right here I wore this in my assumptions video by reading my assumptions video and you guys were asking me like where it was from and I got it from boohoo it's just this little green neon beanie I really really like it and then also I got this little bag my friend Marcus like dies over this he thinks it's the funniest thing ever and I got it because it reminds me of when I was little I feel like I had a bag like this like for dress up and stuff so I just thought that it was fun it's just like a little clear plastic bag and then I also got a few jackets because you guys know like I'm obsessed with jackets this winter and the first one is just this big oversized like cream colored um, pea coat and it's really long. I'm into like really long Jackets and like wearing them with sweatpants and sneakers. Um, that's just like my vibe right now I really am inspired by the like, Kaylee Baldwin and she wears a lot of stuff like that So I picked up this jacket just because I don't know it's tan and plain I thought it was really cute and then I also got a few more jackets and they are just like little puffers I feel like they're so easy to throw on like when I go to school and stuff So I got this one right here. It's just a black hooded one and it's kind of cropped which I like. I think it's so cute. You can wear it with like leggings or even like sweatpants and sneakers and a little top, just like a plain one like I'm wearing right now. I'm um, gonna even add like a pair of gold hoops or a beanie. I just think that it adds like such a nice touch to any outfit. So I just got 
a little plain cropped black puffer jacket and it's in a size 10. I think it's Australian 10 and because they're all in Australian sizes so I think it's like a US 6 Australian 10. But I got that jacket and then I got this one right here which is so cozy. And this one is just a little like fluffy quarter zip like teddy jacket and I think it's so cute because I had the IMG one and it was like big and oversized you guys obviously know what that one looks like but I just feel like that one I don't know I wanted to get one that like looked similar but wasn't as big but you still kind of got like the same vibe so I got this really cute one and it also reminds me of that my Zara jacket that I have um, it's just like a full zip like fluffy jacket, but this one is quarter zip Which I thought was really cute just to like put it on as a little pullover and this last jacket I actually got so many questions on my Instagram I've worn this already and you guys were like going crazy asking me where it was from and it is from boohoo It was so inexpensive and it's so cute So it's just this tan jacket with these black buttons and again I got this one actually in a size 12 which I don't know what that converts to but it's in a size 12 and I got it more oversized I really really like it. I think it's so cute just adds like an extra like something to your outfit. I just love accessorizing like my outfits and using like jackets and pants or wearing jackets with like different pairs of pants and like sneakers and accessories and stuff. I just really like that right now. So yeah, you guys can tell I'm really into jackets. So I got this one right here and it was pretty inexpensive. And yeah, everything's from Boohoo, like I said. Um, I've just been loving like looking at their stuff because it's so affordable and it's also like really cute and you can like wear it and not have to feel bad because like you're spending so much money on it. Like everything's really, really affordable. So I'll have everything linked down below for you guys so you can check it out if you like anything that I got. And yeah, and also let me know how you feel about this light because it seems like very bright. I'm trying to like play around with like the brightness and I just don't know. I feel like I should have filmed it like this because this is like a little bit more dim than mine. Mine is like so harsh. I feel like it was like washing out my skin tone but anyway yeah that is that and it is sunday night like i said um i am just kind of gonna like get ready for my week and plan because i was sick since wednesday so like i'm extremely behind which is actually good that i only have class monday wednesday because i didn't miss like any school stuff so i'm not behind with school i'm just behind with like videos and things that i want to film for you guys so tonight i'm just gonna take this time to like organize my life and like get my shit together and prepare for the week because i have so much stuff to do and all these clothes have been sitting out and you guys have been like asking me where i got them so i instead of like doing a full sit down haul i just thought that it would be easier just to like put it in a haul for you guys or put it in a vlog so you can see all of the items that i got so you guys don't have to wait any longer before like things go out of stock i hate doing that like putting up a vlog or a video and having like things linked and they're out of stock so hopefully these things are still available um because i've been wearing them on my instagram like i said and you guys have been liking them so now i can finally put those clothes away in my closet i literally leave all of my clothes like on clothing racks all over my apartment until i can film a haul um so that was like my step one getting a little haul out of the way so i can like clean up the clothes start cleaning my apartment and get ready for my week. Tyler just left my apartment. Um, he was over for the weekend actually taking care of me because I was so sick, but he took such good care of me. And I'm so thankful that I have him because I honestly don't know like what I would do. Um, he brought me like all of this like medicine and like fluids and stuff on Friday. And also like my dad came and took care of me and I've just been like so sick. So yeah i don't know and then i like tried to like get out and about today and like do a little bit more stuff um his parents came into boston and we went to the bruins game so it was good to like get out and like go in public and like be out of my apartment because honestly i've been inside since wednesday so it felt good to like go out and do that so that was really nice but right now i'm just hanging out i'm really not that hungry um because we did eat at the game i had some peanut butter or peanut filled M&M's or like peanut M&M's whatever and then also I had some pizza so that is that um, but another thing I want to talk about was I think I'm gonna start like cooking from home more just because well like I do cook 
at home a lot. I like don't really order that food that much unless like Tyler and I are hanging out and we um, will like order takeout. And also sometimes I just get like really lazy and I'll order Uber Eats, but I need to stop doing that because I think I got really sick on Wednesday because I ordered Uber Eats and then I like woke up at five in the morning and I was like puking. It was like disgusting. So I need to start like just buying all of my groceries and making everything at home because I like know what goes into my food and stuff like that and I need to stop like eating weird things like I'll I don't know maybe I'm just like grossed out because of like what I ate and like what I got sick off of which is so weird because it was like a green bowl and it had like brown rice and like veggies and like this weird sauce and I'm like so grossed out by sauces now and I literally like ugh, I can't even think about it I will not eat anything with like a sauce on it unless it's like a Dijon mustard on like a wrap. That's like the only thing I probably will eat or like buffalo chicken like buffalo sauce But anything else I'm just like super grossed out by it um, Which I guess is good because it makes like your food healthier if you don't have like sauces or anything So that's just something that I'm like not Gonna be like doing in the future and then also I just want to make sure like this week when I get my groceries I'm just buying like a lot of fresh like veggies and fruit and just eating a lot of stuff like that because I'm like really freaked out by like getting sick and I just want to make sure that like that's never gonna happen again because this is the second time I've had like some sort of like stomach food poisoning like stomach bug type deal in the past couple of months and it is literally the worst feeling in the whole entire world so I'm gonna make like a little grocery list I got this new pad of paper from anthropology actually and this is what it looks like so basically on the top it says today is your day and then it has a little spot for you to like write the date. So I'll just like put the date right here and you have your top priorities. You have your three things that like need to get done that day that I usually just write over here. And then I have like a little to-do list, which is nice because you can cross off everything as you go along. And then what you didn't finish from this day, you can put for tomorrow. And then I just read this part like before I start my next page for my next day the next morning because usually I like do it I'll do it at night for like a Sunday night for Monday morning but usually I'll wake up like Tuesday morning and I'll make a new list for Tuesday and I'll just look at my priorities um, that I didn't get to do from yesterday and put those for the current day and then down here just has like cute little sayings like drink two liters of water sweat it out get out in nature take me moment and eat fruits and vegetables and smile so I love this I will link this down below if they have it on anthropology.com but I just love little like pads of paper like this I know that they have them um, at like TJ Maxx and home goods as well if you want to check there but yeah it's super cute I'm just gonna plan out my day plan out some groceries I want to get on the back of this and like really get my life together So I basically just planned everything that I need to do tomorrow um, on the front of my little list here and then on the back I just have all of my groceries that I need to get and so what I did is I basically just wrote like what I have and what I need and some of the things that I already have I just want to like let you guys know because a lot of you guys are always asking about like my grocery list and my haul and stuff like that and I've done videos where I show like what I get at the grocery store but um, I have some things right now so when I go tomorrow it's not going to be like a full grocery day it's mostly going to be like me getting things that I need because I already have a few things in my fridge so um so I have like carrots cucumbers eggs oatmeal spinach English muffins and hummus and I need to get celery to make celery juice green apples oranges and cottage cheese um and also like I don't know what else to eat I feel like I just get so conflicted because I have like the same thing for breakfast every day and lunch usually I'll have like roughly the same thing um, and I just like don't know really like what to eat I feel like my stomach is still like super sensitive from like being sick and I just like my appetite has changed I just don't like the same things that I liked before I got sick you know when you like eat certain things and then you get sick and then, and then like you don't like them anymore 
that's like what happened to me because Wednesday I ate like a lot of things that like I like and I ended up like getting really really sick so now I like can't eat them anymore which is kind of like annoying because now I don't know what to make for dinner um so I'm gonna have to come up with things to buy and yeah basically I only have like my staples right now and I want to get some more apples and stuff like that just because I love having those um as like snacks like throughout the day I just love apples and another thing that I've been getting recently is one of you guys told me to get the Starbucks iced coffee the blonde roast one and I'm gonna try that tomorrow morning I think um, just making iced coffee at home because sometimes I'm like not in the mood to use my Keurig and I'm excited that I just got this so I'll let you guys know how I like that um, but another thing that I've been obsessing over are just like these little shots. I got these from Whole Foods today and I got some yesterday. This one's just an immunity boost and basically what it is, oh it says it right here. It's like ginger root, turmeric, and whatever that is and black pepper. So it's just a really nice thing to take to like boost your immunity system. My sister Emma actually takes these all the time. She gets them at the organic market. And I'm excited to try this brand. It's called Vive Organic. I haven't tried them yet. And this one is a wellness rescue. So I'm going to be having this tomorrow morning. Basically it just has, oh my god, oregano. I'm like so scared because that sounds disgusting. But I know that elderberry is supposed to be really good for like sickness. And ginger root and cayenne pepper. So I'm excited to try those. I just have like those two little shots in here. Um, but yeah, basically my fridge is just like looking super sad and empty. And yeah, but I'm gonna start like cleaning up my apartment and getting ready for the week. I just cleaned a bunch of my water bottles because obviously after being sick, like I wanna clean literally everything. So I cleaned my hydro flask, but I'm so funny, when I was laying in bed sick, I ordered another hydro flask online because you guys know I have like the hot pink one. And this one is, I think the 32 ounce, um, but this one is the 40. And you can't really tell the difference. This one's just like a lot thicker, so it doesn't fit in the cup holder in my car. My sister Emma just got this one, and it's just a lot bigger, like taller, and it's skinnier. So it'll fit in my cup holder, and I just got a plain black one because I already had a bright pink one, but I ordered like a hot pink top for it. So I'm really excited for that to come in because it'll just be like all hot pink, and it like reminds me of summer, and it's really cute. So I'm obsessed with my Hydro Flask amazing and having like the little sippy straw part for it is like my favorite thing in the whole entire world so I just got the same thing but in black so it just looks like that so I'm like getting everything in my apartment like cleaned up and also today Tyler and I bought this Lysol spray I've like been spraying everything and wiping down all my surfaces and these are just all of my like medicines I had like two different sicknesses I had a cold so I had like some decongesting things and then this right here is just some ibuprofen and then Pepto-Bismol because for like stomach aches and when I had like my stomach thing I had that. Um, these are a life savior. They're my non or noon hydration tablets and they're just the lemon lime ones. So those are amazing. This is some more ibuprofen, nasal spray and melatonin. So this has been like my life for the past week just being sick. But another thing I got some more flowers um, just because I like to put new flowers every single week in my little vase and these ones are just red roses and it's funny because I usually get my flowers from Whole Foods and they're only $10 but since Valentine's Day is in a few days they were 24 so they like jacked up the price because it's like Valentine's Day week and they thought that no one was gonna notice but I totally noticed so that was not cool <laughs> but also my dad got me these because I was sick so he got me some hydrangeas which was so sweet and thoughtful so I just have like all my flowers and Tyler was like Mags you know that Valentine's Day is coming up and you're literally gonna have like all flowers on your whole entire island I was like yeah like I love that I cannot wait for it to look like that I just got out of the shower and now I'm doing a mask and is anybody like me I literally just wear all of my boyfriend's clothes like all the time um, to bed and stuff like that, but I'm so comfy. I put on this gray t-shirt Put my hair up in this headband these I just got from like CVS and they really help like keep all the little baby hairs out of your face When you do a mask because there's nothing worse than having them like stick to your mask I hate that so much, but I'm just doing my favorite one that you guys um, Know about it is the Ole Hendrickson cold plunge pore mask I just feel like my face needed it like being sick 
and I reached for that one in my drawer. And if you guys want to see like a skincare drawer, I can definitely show you guys like a tour of all my skincare products because I love watching those types of videos. So let me know if you guys would be interested in that. And I'm also going to be doing a skincare routine because these are like my everyday products and then products I don't use every day I keep like inside my little drawer right here. Um, but I just washed all my makeup brushes. They're all so clean. I'm so excited for them to dry and just put them away and be like all spotless i like love this i'm just having a night i'm just like really getting my life back together because i feel like my skin is just crazy i'm sick my life is just like an absolute mess because i'm not even kidding you guys i don't think i've been able to get out of bed um since wednesday like i was saying before i've been sick since wednesday so i literally laid in bed all thursday all friday all saturday and then today i finally like got up and tried to like get outside my mom was like maggie you need to go outside and so i did and i was at the bruins game and i was like sitting there and i was like falling asleep i'm like i'm literally so exhausted and sick i need to like go home and lay like do a face mask so finally i'm like getting my life together and it feels so good that I like have all my stuff done for this week because it kind of just gives me an idea of like what I need to do and all the stuff that I need to um, like have done and like figure out oh my god because I've been really on top of like my homework and stuff so right now I just really need to get on top of like my life and then get a good mix of both of them you know what I mean like school and life sometimes clash right now they're clashing for me um, and I think I'm more like into my school routine and I need to like get into a good life routine. And also that reminds me, I need to also get lemons at the grocery store because I want to um, start drinking a lot more lemon water. I used to do that all the time. And I don't know why I stopped, um, but I want to get lemons. Oh, I also need yogurt. Uh, yogurt question mark. I don't know if I'm going to get that yet. And yeah, I think that's it. Okay, but anyway, my nose is like dripping. I need to blow it, but I can't because I have a face mask on. Um, but another thing I wanted to say was, oh, Tyler's so cute. I like miss him already. He just left and I like, I don't know. I feel like I miss him when I'm not with him. You know what I mean? And it just like makes me sad because I wish I could be with him like every single day because he truly is like my best friend in the whole world. And I just feel like when I'm with him, I can like be myself and like I don't really care about anything you know what I mean and something I've also noticed um like when I'm with him versus like when I'm not with oh my god my nail just broke yeah I need to get my nails done tomorrow my dip is like chipping off chipping its life away um but also something I noticed is that like the more we spend time together and like as long as we've been dating I feel like progressively I've just stopped I don't know, I, I feel like I'm like a different person. He like makes me a better person, you know what I mean? I don't know, just like having that one person that you can like spend so much time with and like not care about like what other people think. You can just like be yourself and they like bring out the best in you and you're like so happy. I just feel like, I don't know, it's like a really good feeling and yeah. But anyway, my mask is like everywhere and like I was saying before, I just kind of wanted to do a mask because um, it really like this one really brings out all like the impurities in your skin and just kind of like resets everything so that is exactly what I'm trying to do I need my skin to like get back on its grind because I like, didn't do my skincare routine being sick and that's like something that I wish that I did but it's okay because we're starting next week fresh I'm gonna get a manicure um, probably Tuesday and my nails are pretty long because I get like the dip gel or dip nail whatever dip powder and it makes your nails like super hard and um mine like just grow really long so i honestly might like keep the length but get like a really pretty like neutral color because the black like when they chip you can literally see and that didn't happen last time i got them done i got like a new color for vacation and that didn't happen so it's kind of weird that they're breaking but um, anyway, I'm gonna like get my nails done and get my eyebrows done because my eyebrows are awful And I also have an event on Tuesday night, which I think I'm gonna vlog probably um, Because it is really exciting. It's for first aid beauty and it's downtown and I'm gonna go with Kaylee So I'm really excited about that. She's gonna come to my apartment We're gonna like get ready and then go to the event together. It's like a Galentine's Day theme type thing so I need to figure out what I'm gonna wear for that also 
but yeah this is just basically what I'm planning on doing this week you guys now know my whole entire week I also have so many exciting YouTube videos to show you guys or to like make for you guys I'm so so excited for one of them I ordered all of these clothes online and I put together all these outfits and I can't really tell you guys what it's about but it's really exciting and I know you guys are gonna love it and yeah so that is basically what I've been up to and what I'm going to be doing this week. I just kind of wanted to do like a Sunday night in my life, um, like getting back into routine type video where like, you know, getting preparing for the week. That's what I'm saying. This is basically what I do. I just have like a chill, relaxing Sunday, um, maybe do a face mask, kind of like get my life together, put my priorities in order, plan my week out. But I feel like this video has been like super long, just me talking and kind of updating you guys. So I think I'm going to end it off here and take my face mask off, get in the bed, do my homework, and go on Pinterest and start planning my Valentine's Day. I'm going to have it here at my apartment. Tyler's going to come over and we're going to like make dinner and then like go out for dessert and like have wine and stuff. So it's going to be really fun. I want to like plan a way to like decorate my apartment like very Valentine's Day vibe. So I'm going to go on Pinterest before bed. Um, oh my god, it's 9 o'clock. Yeah, I need to go. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna like set everything up and figure out like what I'm gonna do for that. But yeah, so I love you guys and thank you so much for watching this vlog. I hope you liked it. I'm sorry that it was all over the place. I'm just like really not feeling well and I kind of just needed to like get everything back in line and all situated and organized. But this is basically how I do it. I write lists. I sit down and I prioritize, I go on Pinterest and I do a face mask and I clean my makeup brushes. But yeah, so I love you guys and I hope you enjoyed this video and it inspired you to have a relaxing, getting your shit together Sunday night also. And yeah, so thank you guys for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye.